<laughs> I can't remember how many times I wanted to do that before. At work, the mall, the driving on the freeway. And here's the thing, I shoot her and I know she won't die, which is nice because I never felt I had the right to take another person's life anyway. I don't know. Remember that time you took us to the drive-in theater and you snuck me in because you were scared to get to pay for me? Then you got me out of the suitcase and they saw me and they thought I was a midget. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you do. I was a midget that he didn't want to tell you the whole thing. What are you looking at, buddy? Would you leave him alone? What are you looking at? Yeah, you. I'm talking to you. Only come on and kick your ass. Would you stop it? Don't kick his ass. I know. Just knock it off. What are you doing? You know it doesn't work on me, right? Yeah. You shouldn't sneak up on people like that. You new here? Yeah, yeah. I needed to change the scenery. I was going to pass the time, right? There is no more time. Okay. Okay, well, uh, have a nice day. Yeah, right. You too. You, uh... Okay. All right. <laughs> Weird. It's admirable. A bit futile. I respect the fact that he's compelled to do his duty. I also have no respect for people who cling blindly to a useless sense of obligation. So, evidently I'm in conflict with myself on this issue. You know, it's not that people can't be killed, because they can. It just seems to take a lot of effort. Yeah, that's pretty gruesome. And like I said, it takes a lot of energy. Not much of that these days. And I'm not sure why. I'm just asking you to take my word for it. I'll take a slice of pepperoni. I don't work here. But you know how to make the pizza, right? I know how to make that pizza, yeah. And I'm hungry. Perhaps I can offer you a trade. 